Welcome back to the Feeble Files. Feeble, uh, frustrated in his mission to find any kind of transport and finding his own bike clamped, is uh, turning to distractions. He's going to try to grab a machine, which presumably has to combine with tokens to operate. Oh, I hope this is going to be a mini game. It costs 20 tokens. I don't have enough. Oh, that's the big one. You've got to build up to it. There's got to be something good in there. So let's talk to the virtual citizen in the kiosk who can let us play the virtual machine. Hopefully. Whoa, city dude, you startled me, man. That's like totally awesome. Hmm? Can I have some more tokens, citizen? What's that big new machine there? Why can't we use real money in here? We have a very strange way with words. Nice talking to you. Bye. Can I have some more tokens, please? Uh, can citizen? I have some more tokens, citizen? Sorry, man. Arcade policy. You gotta use what you got first. What's that big new machine there? What's that big new machine up there? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> what you've got there is the absolute latest in virtual entertainment. It's called the Super Virtua Challenge 4. Can I have a go at it? It's not for the faint-hearted city, dude. Well, I think I can take it. It's 200 tokens per go, man. But if you beat it, you win a free ticket to the Metro Prime Zoo. 200 tokens? That's a lot of tokens. Oh, but you should see it, man. It's like really awesome. Interesting. Why can't we use real money? Why can't we use real money in here? Company Directive City, dude. Well, I thought it might be something like that. Hey, it's no sweat, man. There's plenty of tokens to go around. You have a very strange way with words. You have a very strange way with words. Yeah, man. It's called Earth Speed. I've been to Earth a few times. Yeah? I learnt it from the Earth Invaders machine. Eat laser monkeys, and then they say, No alien, dude, don't shoot us! Check it out, man. Whoa, I love it when they grovel. You're weird. You're not kidding there, man. Nice talking with you. Bye. Uh, nice talking with you. Bye. Yeah, be cool, man. Okay. So, if I don't have enough for Toys and Novelties, I don't think I have enough for the Virtual Machine. So I might have to be playing Simon the Sorcerer for a very long time. Let's just double check that. There's a notice on it saying I should talk to a supervisor before using this machine. Simon the Sorcerer it is. In this game, again. you must watch the hats and guess where the frog is. After the hats have stopped moving, select one and see if you're right. Concentrate hard, everybody. Yeah, I am tracing it with my finger. Mm -hmm. This one. Well done! You've got five tokens in the bank! Right, I need to get to 200 to play the Virtua thing. Ugh. Sorcerer's Challenge. Can you turn the coins over so that all but one show the same picture? Selecting one causes the adjacent ones to turn also, so it's not as easy as it looks. Oh. Well... This is a adventure game, it's a puzzle. Let's see if we can work this one out. Um, what do you do? So if I did that one, it would turn all of those. Okay. I have. I have it. Um, and then. And then. And then. And then. And then. Oh, we're doing fairly well. And then. And then. And then. And then. And then. And then. Uh, 
this might get frustrating. No way! You've lost! Oh. Come back and play again soon! Try to match all the pairs by flipping the counters. Be careful though, you don't have much time! Okay, I think I can do this one of played uh, memory games for children. Um, I think these are all characters from the first time in the Sorcerer game, although I don't remember it that well. There's wizardy types. I think the one in red is Simon. Um, I don't really remember the other characters. Yeah, there's definitely some... Co oh, there's Sordid. I think that's the, the baddie is Sordid. And there's, yeah, some kind of pasta lizard thing. Um, oh, I, yeah, got it. Um, I'm not going too badly. Simons, um, and then that's come kind of no yoga thing. Yo, yeah, two of them. Uh, ye yeah, those the cave thing and pointy hat. Ah, sorted, sorted to double swordedness, double magic. Okay, I do that one. Well done! You've got five tokens mm. in the bank! Alright, let's continue. Round two. What's it gonna be? Goblin banging? It just gets worse. It's a bit like playing Simon Says. Copy the tune on the goblin's heads. Hopefully I can... Oh, and then that. Hopefully if I concentrate I can... Get through this. No way! Why did that with that one? Oh, Simon the Sorcerer, you... Right, Can front. you turn oh, the coins over what? so that all but one show the same picture? This is round Selecting one. Selecting one. No way. You've lost. Come back and play again soon. What do you think? Middle? Middle. Well done. You've got five tokens in the bank. I'm gonna collect those tokens. No way! You've lost! Come back and play again I don't soon. feel like a loser. Swamp stew, that's new. What's the swampling got in his stew? Can you work it out within the time limit? This? Oh, I've got to put a combo in, alright. Uh, one of everything, obviously. I've got two right, two wrong, two neutral. Huh? So let's try shrimpy things, mushrooms, 
uh, swampy, oh, I just wish I had more. Eyes, uh, herbs, boot, too right, too wrong, too neutral. So I'm not quite sure. So there's two that aren't in it, and then two that are doubled, maybe? So, two of those, two of those, um, that and that. Three wrong answers. So definitely that. Just put them in the right order as well. Boot, herb, boot, worm. Two right, one wrong. I don't understand why there's blank spaces. So it can't be positional because that time I've had prawn first every time and the first one hasn't always been ticked. So let's go mushroom, prawn, mushroom, prawn, mushroom, prawn. One cross. Mushroom, prawn, herb, herb, mushroom, prawn. Huh? There's a uh, prawn, mushroom, herb, herb, prawn, mushroom. One tick, one cross. I don't understand. Two ticks, no crosses. Oh, so we've got two correct and in the correct positions? So the first time I got two correct and the second time I got two correct. So I'm pretty sure it's going to be that. Oh, no, it's not necessarily that and that, is it? Um, so no crosses. So that's going to be the right combo. But what order are they going? Okay, let's try and work it out. So, I think eyeballs are bad. Eyeballs are bad. Let's not do eyeballs. So, I'm going to stick with that. And then do swamp boot. Swamp boot? No. I don't know how. So, I don't know how the same. Uh, I don't know how that one can have a cross in it. Oh, bums. Uh, this, that, this, that, 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 this. No way! You huh? lost. Explain the rules to me at least, will you? Soon. Middle. Thanks. I'm definitely collecting. Uh. Well done! You've got five tokens in the bank. I'm collecting Come those tokens. Play again soon. Okay, I've saved the game. And I think... I think I'm supposed to put tokens in it. I've got enough for a go on the grab machine. Let's give it a whirl. Oh, there's more than one thing. Oh, I hope this isn't going to be like a real grab one. What do I actually want? That's the question. Oh. Oh, you have to keep your hand, finger on the... Oh. This isn't going to be easy. Is it? Oh, poo. <laughs> Why can nothing be simple? It costs 20 tokens. I don't have enough. Great. Well, that's dispiriting. And I don't know what I need from it. This is all poo, isn't it? This is all poo. Ventresoft released a saved game just after the arcade section to allow people to carry on playing. Support. Feeble files. The amount of CDs I cannot install the game. Games are still but won't run. Running in Windows XP. Um, arcade. Save game. Ah. Ah. Oh. Ah. Ah. Uh. 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 Save file. 
you know what would be fairer? Is to just have... Well, not have this section at all, but uh, if you were to have this section, have the player complete one of each of the puzzles. How about that? Probably with no time limit. Um, and then you've got as much, as many tokens as you require to proceed with the game. Dwarf balancing? Use all the dwarves to balance the seesaw. Watch out for the time. You what? What seesaw? Uh. Do, do they weigh different? Oh, they weigh differently. I've got to guess how they weigh. Oh, uh, oh crikey, uh, so I guess if I can learn the, so there's lots of heavy, no oh, way. you've lost, come back and play again soon. Well, that was something new. No way, no way, no way, you've lost. Sugar crap. No way! You've lost, lost, lost. Find the frog. Yes, I can find the frog. Back in the middle, I think. Yes, I found that frog. I found it. Continue. Please give me something I can do. Dwarf bouncing. Well, I, th I think I can because I think it's going to be the same Use every time. So I just need to work out what the solution the is. Seesaw. Ah, they're balanced. Now will I be able to remember that again? I can always go back and look at the footage. Here's that solution again. Cool playing. You've got 20 tokens in the oh. bank. Ooh, I'm quite tempted to collect that. I'm going to collect that. 20 is good. Come back and play again soon. This 20 is only one tenth of the way to <laughs> the virtual machine. Ticket price. So I could do four out of six. That's pretty good. Gonna continue. It's worth the risk. Come on, something I can do. Goblin banging. I can definitely do that. It's Thank a you. bit like playing Simon already. Says. Copy the tune on the goblins' heads. Will do. Oh. Oh. Right, do I call it quits at two or do I risk it? Cool playing. You've got 20 tokens in the bank. Okay, so I've used up two, there's two, two more. I'm going to risk it. There's two more I could potentially do. What's it going to be? Please be the dwarfs or the dwarf bouncing. All right, I've got a shot. Um, Use all the dwarves to, do to it. balance the seesaw. Watch out for the time. I can't remember. This is still the same recording session, so I can't remember exactly where. Um. Yes. Here's that other solution. I'm definitely calling it quits here. I've only got a one in three chance of anyone I can complete. You've got one hundred tokens 100? in the bank. Yes, please. Come back and play again soon. Phew. So, uh, if my theory is correct, I might have 140 now, which is so much better. Right, saving. It's day three. We're running out of food. We're on our last boot. Must complete game. Sorted. Sorted. Yes. 
So any little one in three chance Way of getting dwarf bouncing. Definitely tokens in the bank. I'm definitely collecting. Thanks. Okay, so on the right. Yes. Yes, frog. Way to go! You've got one hundred tokens in the bank. Collect these Come bad back. boys. Play again soon. Okay, save. Oh, that, that's it. I'm going to go and eat a boot. Can you turn the coins over so that all but one show the same picture? Collecting one causes your shape. It's still going. I wonder if it's because I haven't clicked. No oh. way! You've lost! Well, left. Yes! Way to go! You've got 100 tokens in the bank! Fantastic. Collect. Come back and so, play again soon. I think theoretically I might have 400 now. We should. At least 100. We should do everything I need. So I'm going to save this. This was definitely a good use of my time because now I can play the virtual machine. There's a notice on it saying I should talk to a supervisor before using this machine. Have done. Use now? There's a note saying I should speak to the supervisor about using this machine. Hey, city dude. Yeah? Can I have a go at Super Virtua Challenge 4 machine, citizen? Can I have a go at that Super Virtua Challenge 4 machine, citizen? Whoa, man. I mean, whoa, man. You don't know what you're letting yourself in for, city dude. I'm ready for anything. Whatever you say, man. Just don't say I didn't warn you. Here's the tokens. Okay, this is all automated. I'm not controlling this part of the game. Step right up, dude. In here? Yeah. Huh? Strap yourself in, man. Yeah, I don't have to do anything here, just watching the uh, next generation graphics. This sequence really doesn't have to go on this long just to make the impression that it's a wishy kind of game. Uh huh. You win. Play again. Hey, man! No, I need my credit for something else. You are right, man. What do you think? Uh, that was a. Uh, that was a. Uh, it was a. Uh, pretty wild, right? I feel unusual. That's like perfectly normal, man. I think I need to go and lie down somewhere dark. Brain drain. Awesome. Have I got my zoo ticket? Because that's the. That was what I was angling for. Doesn't look like it. I'm feeling a bit better now. Get used to it after a while, huh? Do I get my ticket? I won. Didn't I? Sure did, man. Zoo ticket. Here's your ticket. Oh, man. What did they... Uh, yeah, so why, why was any of that sequence necessary? I mean, I could just help myself to a game on the machine once I had enough tickets for it and...
got a ticket spat out at the end. I'm keen to get to the zoo before it closes, but for the first, let's, um, let's have a go on the grabbers. I'll see if I can work out how this thing functions. If not, I can load. So, I've got to hold down the buttons to do it. So, I mean, it looks like there's probably a fish, a ball, a smiley face, something hidden behind the fish. And this blue boat, maybe, that I can get. So, maybe five things. Right, that looks like it's... So I can't tell where that is in spatially related to the fish. So if I just tap it, and then, huh? Oh no! Oh, so I'm not. I'm maybe not move because in one of these in real life, you'd move it across and then forwards. But maybe I'm just moving it across and then straight down to wherever the thing is. Let's load and try again. You know what? These are probably as annoying as real life ones. I was kind of hoping this bit would be easier than the arcade machine section, but it's not proving to be. Or something like that was in front oh, of the ball. Poo. Perfect skill. Yes, okay, master the fish. What's the point of a plastic fish? Okay, I think I've got an approximate technique. I'm going for the cat. And then down to where it gets spat dark brown. There on the back. Oh, yes. Brilliant. It's a stuffed toy. Ah, <sighs> well, you know this kind of um Likely science fiction themed uh, satirical uh, consumerist stuff does remind me of Space Quest, but I remember having a lot more fun playing Space Quest. Maybe it was just the age I was. So if I'm going for the ball, down a little bit. Perfect skill! Ah, nice! First time. So I think there's kind of a set Perfect for distance. a quick game of Omnifun. Huh. A set distance away from things that you have to be. Yeah, I won. I always wanted a frisbee. A frisbee. I think we might have to call it a, a flying disc for, for legal reasons. I've come to the conclusion that you don't need to go as far down towards the ship as it appears you might need to. So probably just about here it should do, hopefully. Oh brilliant! Yes. Cool! A model spaceship. Yes, I won a grab a machine. Let's have a look at my haul. A toy spaceship. Nice. Useful. An unrealistic looking stuffed toy. Oh, cute. It's a ball. A big ball. A big red ball. Mm, exciting. It's a red plastic fish. Fishy? It's got a happy citizen face on it. Oh, excellent. I wonder if Dell would like one of these. I'm sure she would. That was time well spent. Let's go to the zoo. Amazingly, having not made a game for several decades, Adventuresoft still have a website, and they still have their address in Sutton Coalfield, and they have an online store where you can still buy the big box edition of the Feeble Files, new, for £9.99. What a world. <laughs>